so hello guys welcome back to my channel so this is such a sad video you know ah uh, youtube makeup artist mel thompson is dead um she died at the age of 35 leaving behind a husband and four kids this is so sad so sad and right now the cause of her death is unknown to the public um she normally um shared videos of like her makeup tutorials and um reviews in like product hauls you know she is beautiful she is gorgeous this is so sad and her kids are really young you know this is just some kind of sad news that you don't want to wake up in you don't want to wake up to you know what i mean it is so sad and i just i just can't stand the fact that like especially for like women you know what i mean you work so hard to get to like a certain point you know what i mean then it makes you i don't know like it, it makes me sometimes look at life like just nothing emptiness you know what i mean all the struggle all the hustle you know she always putting out content always doing her thing it is so sad it is sad and her husband shared a message on her instagram page um let me read it for you guys it's really long i'm gonna post it somewhere <clears throat> you can read along with me or you can pause this video and read the message um the husband said mel sadly passed away yesterday it's really hard to just choose 10 photos yeah she got smiles on all those photos i lost a beautiful person i just wanted to show the smiles she brought i've had to answer so many texts of people just checking in without even knowing of her passing oh my god it's great to see how loved she was and she loved all you right back i'll continue to love her and miss her forever she was such a pillar for our family oh my god i can just imagine like the kids would talk to her non-stop oh i know that feeling and she was constantly talking with them and trying to help them with their stuff and no matter how bad she felt she would still rub my back when I came and jumped on the bed next to her while she was walking tirelessly to put out content. Yeah, the struggle is real. It's really real. Everybody knows how talented she was as an artist and with her helpful knowledge. But those closer to her know how truly wonderful she was. She would have done anything to help anyone without a second thought. I wish I had her back. Oh my God. This is so sad. This is just so sad. Like, it makes you sometimes like, you just want to be like, what? what is, like, life it's so empty it's so meaningless you know what i mean i feel i feel so sorry for the husband and the kids especially the fact that they're just little kids right now you know what i mean that is so sad that's so sad well it is a sad news you know on me like for, like the youtube community in general and she was just 35 35 years old man 35 years old this is so sad <sighs> may her gentle soul rest in peace she was so hard working as i feel i understand like putting out content is not easy you know what i mean just to figure out like what you want to what you want to film you know then come on with this content then sit down to edit i've had times when i've tried to like edit one single video like three four hours you know then go back to like trying to like post a video you run out of storage you know 
and you spend like how many hours trying to like upload a video you can't upload the video it's just it's too much like too much involved you know what i mean creating content that's one thing that people don't understand sometimes but at the same time you can't blame people like if you're not into this world of youtube you'll not understand like that the struggle is really real and for her to have put on for her to have put in so much work i think let me see i think it says she started she started her channel in like 2013 yeah if i'm not mistaken she started her channel 2013 can you just imagine the hard work all these years just the work that she's put in all these years and just she just died like that it is so sad and i think she's from um tennessee if i'm not mistaken this is so sad it's so sad it's such a sad news really sad i feel for the kid like as a parent i really i really feel for her kid <sighs> God. all i can say is like may her soul just rest in peace it is so sad sad and i kind of like really like the love that people show sometimes like if you if you're like a content creator and you got like this large group okay of followers like people really be there for you you know what i mean like people will genuinely like if they like you they love you or however you want to say it and they love the kind of content that you create there are people that are going to be there for you you know what i mean there are people that are even going to contribute money just to help you out if you're going through something which i i feel like that is one beautiful thing that is one great thing about like the youtube community in general you know people are so supportive people are so loyal like if they know you're genuine okay then you're going through something they are willing to like help you there are people that will go like any length on this youtube to help you to support you that's one thing that i love i love so much about youtube you know but once again my heart so just rest in peace and all i can say like, i just pray to god that god should um grant her family like that just give them the grace to go through like this difficult moment this 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 trying moment it's not it's not easy to like oh my god i don't even know what to say it's not easy like to lose a child to lose a wife to lose a mother it's a tough like it's really tough you know it's really tough sometimes it's it, it it's just it's just something that takes like takes forever to heal um the wound you know what i mean all that empty space in the life of like loved ones is something that don't go away like sometimes people feel like the pain just go away the pain don't go away the pain don't go away you just try to like gather the strength to like just keep moving but the, the pain does never it never goes away you know what i mean it never goes away sometimes when you by yourself people don't understand like the pains that you go through like you sit behind closed doors and you just cry the pain don't go away you know so all i can say is like just i just pray to god to like just grant the family like peace of mind so they'll be able to like go through this trying moment this is tough.